Hey guys, so I'm just going to show you how to make an animated title in Filmora. I got requests for this on my main channel after doing a video with a lot of stuff going on in the title. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to select a clip from an old video of mine. Um, so while that exports, let me just explain to you really quick what an animated title is. Basically, it's a title with an animation on it and with different stuff going on around it. A lot of people ask me how I do a lot of my animations because this website, I mean, this um, software is not really friendly with animations. Like, there's a whole entire process you have to go through to make a good animation. So let me just select my little clip and put it onto my timeline. So, okay, the key here is to not go with the templates that Filmora gives you. If you just go into the advanced editing options, you can find a lot more things to do, and that honestly makes the editing so much better. So just go into your titles and choose whatever title. The title that you choose does not matter whatsoever. It only, it only The only thing that matters is... Um, actually, no, nothing matters. I mean, I mean, whatever title you choose, you're going to delete everything. And from the inside, um, I'll explain in a bit, um, but just choose something simple that's not going to take you too much time to um, delete, and you'll see what I mean in a minute. So I'm just going to choose this one because it's very simple, and I'm just going to drag it onto the timeline of the um, video. So basically, um, uh, do not click on the little, like, pen that, like, just edit, edits, 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 do not click on the little pencil that edits, it's, Normally, um, I don't really know, but anyways, click on the little pencil with the notepad. That's the one that's going to take you to the advanced editing option and the one that's going to bring up to you a bunch more stuff to do. So this is what it looks like when you get in there and this gives you so many more options of what of things to do with um, those software. So you can delete the entire text and by doing this you can actually like add your own images and stuff and animate those. But we're making an animated title so um, if you want an in-depth video on the other thing you can tell me but we're making an animated title here so basically you just choose the shape you want. I'm going to choose a little speech bubble but as you can see there's so many other things you can choose um, in here and I'm just going to choose this speech bubble because I'm making a pop-up so basically just center it whatever and then you can choose a fill it can be a picture fill or a color fill I'm choosing a gradient fill and I'm making it blue to white and then you can just choose the angle and whatnot but anyways you would spend more time on this if you actually were going to use it on a video which I'm not so this is just an example so then just put on your text and you can choose a font and you can personalize your text so much more than this you can choose color fills or gradient fills or picture fills or uh, shadows or borders that you can personalize it so much more but basically just grab it and personalize it and whatever you want to do with your text and write whatever you want and there I'm just gonna write um, like and basically so once that's done you just go into the animation tab on the editing part and then you can choose an animation whatever you want and you will see sometimes when you click on certain animations those little two bars will pop up and those two bars basically mean the amount of time that the final product will be on screen before like the animation so all the like dark blue is the animation and the rest is just the actual text and as you can see once you have that saved uh, with all the animations it'll just make it a compound clip because it's the one title that you chose so this is what basically what it would look like in the video if I was actually going to use this in a video I don't know why it's taking a little bit long there we go so as you can see, it's what it looked like. I'm not actually going to use this for a video, so I don't really care if it looks okay or not. But that's about it for this video. That's basically what you do. You just select a title, delete everything, choose a shape or a picture, personalize it however you want, and add animations. Honestly, this is how I do most of my animations on this software, but if you guys want me to do more in-depth videos on this, or you just want me to do more Filmora tutorials, definitely let me know.